Right, so here's one for you, uh, BMW. Ladies um, decided to put some paint in the boot. Well, not literally. She didn't really decide to put the paint itself. It was in a tin, um, which obviously came open. Now she's kind of took our advice. Um, she's covered it with the wet towels. Uh, we did put a note on the website to explain that sometimes people cover the majority of it with the wet towels and then leave areas exposed, which is kind of what's happened here. That so these little bits here, of course, will dry. It can be more difficult. But this is uh, an emulsion paint. The emulsion's got some kind of plastic in it. I don't really fully uh, know, but um, you know, it, it's not. It, it, you know, it doesn't wash off once it's dried. If you put it, if it did, then it would wash off your wall, wouldn't it? So um, I'll reveal a bit more now. Um, it has started to dry. You can see under there, under the tea cloth there, it's uh, you know it started to dry. So she couldn't get to us for a couple of days. Um, we've kept it wet. Although we have, she has done the right thing. Is this is a, a Mr. Muscle thing, but it's actually got water in it and she sprayed everything, the trigger sprayed it all to keep it all moist. Uh, so, and the weather's not been too unkind. I mean, <laughs> it's been raining and horrible, so it's been ideal in a lot of ways because it's allowed, not not cut, not cooked this. But you can see by the way I'm pulling this back at the moment that it is quite hard. So, okie dokie, so there you go. I'll show you what we're about to do with it what we can do and what we can't. Usually these things get worse before they get better. So I'm going to go away and put some gloves on and uh, we'll, sh we'll be back with you uh, when we've got the next stage to show you. Okay. Okay. So there's a little bit more. I've just um, lifted this up and cleaned the towels. The towels have just been thrown and show you that it's actually gone a little bit further than we thought. Okay, I thought I'd better show you the mucky, messy bit. Um, right, the boot carby came out fairly easy. Those plastic parts just unclipped. And then I've just put the pressure washer on there for a couple of minutes, just a couple of seconds, and it's loosening it up quite nicely. So it's going to get a little bit loud, but I'll give you an idea what we're going to do. Right, there we go. That won't take too long. It just keeps on diluting, to be honest. So probably take about 20 minutes, half an hour, and, and this, this uh, steam cleaner will get hot, so, and it will clean it better, but you can't afford to go too close, um, keeping it at a respectable distance, uh, so that it does no harm to the fabric. Uh, just note that the bits that was, weren't dry, that have been wet with the lady's towel, are coming off relatively easy. You can see there that uh, I can create a hole in it there with a jet washer. If I move across here, I can do the same here. The jet washer's removing it quite well. Here now that's dried, it's peeling off and breaking off. You can see there when I'm pulling that, that's coming off as a, like, a, like a lump of tape. <laughs> um, it's not all going to come off quite as easy as this, but you can see there that uh, it's not going to be too bad. You may need to replace this clip, but a few things like that. Um, and I've pulled away some of it out of here, and it's left bits in the tiny bits in the gaps. But you can see here, I can pull this back, and it's coming off. And the tank there is going to be a bit different, and you can feel this is all a bit soft. So there's obviously wet paint in the middle of that. But I'm going to undo all that and try and get it all out in one piece. It might come. There's the side pod drying nicely, and that's all been steam cleaned. And then there's the boot carpet sitting there drying nicely. Both of them look pretty much like new again. So there you go, so far so good. in the paint. There's a hard skin over that, or rubbery skin. And uh, I've taken that off. So we've taken the tank out, jet washed and cleaned that. 
that's pretty perfect really, quite easy to do. And now we've just got this last little bit, so I've got the vacuum in here now. Finishing it with air. What the air does is this little machine rotates and it blows air it. and also just a very fine liquid just to finish off. Just to make sure there's nothing in any of the little pockets and in the little grooves and there's no little puddles that are going to run out of the little things there. So that's lovely there. There you go, and then the screws have just got to go back in. And we're getting back to a bit of normality. Um, there it all is. The carpet goes back nicely. Stuff on there. Let's put the screw back. Two. And three. It's a bunch of one, isn't it? There you go. Right. Lovely. Stuff in there now. Pass the shelf back and everything, and uh, there we go.